We are under the bright lights tonight as MLB Network welcomes you to this presentation of Major League Baseball. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the American League's Houston Astros and the Los Angeles Dodgers. Two great hitters lead their teams to battle next on MLB Network. Here's the second baseman, Jose Altuve. He'll get us started in this one Leading under the Houston. lights. Second baseman, Jose Altuve. Pitch swung on and hit in the air. Puig's got a read on it. And he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. So the bases are empty with one man gone. And that'll bring in the center fielder, Cameron Mabin. Mabin. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. The fastball here is he'll take a look at ball one. One and oh. Skied into straightaway right. Puig over to his left. Two gone. Stepping into the box, George Springer. First chance for him here in the top of the first with nobody on. Now a fastball, a bit too low here. It's ball one. Here's the 1 0. Here's a high foul ball as it finds a lucky fan in the upper deck for a souvenir. He's clearly looking to hit off the fastball and adjust. That's a pretty good swing after seeing two fastballs now in a row. And there's ball two now. Hard hit ball to second, taken in by Forsythe. They'll whip this one to first in time, and that ends the inning. At the plate, Chris Taylor. He'll lead things off here in the bottom Leading half of the Dodgers. first. Center fielder, Chris Taylor. Knuckle curve breaks outside for ball one. The windup and the 1 0 pitch. Oh, much too tardy on the fastball. 1 and 1. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Looks like he swung it underwater that time for strike two. That was a good pitch right there. Started at the knees, got the hard sink down, got him to swing right through it. Beautiful. And he'll lay off the curveball that's in the dirt that time, and it's back to even now at two and two. Swing and a miss as he couldn't connect on the two seamer, and that's out number one. Here's Corey Seeger. Corey Seeger. First offering on its way. And that misses for ball one. Bases are empty, one man out. That's to the left and foul. One ball, one strike. Well, now we've seen the combination of the two seamer and the cutter. That is a lethal combination because now he's taken away the ability of the hitter to sit on one direction of the pitch. Swing and that's hit out of play up into the plaza level. Into the windup. Here comes the 2 2 pitch. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Looking up is Maven. And it's gone. Into the box now. Justin Turner. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Justin Turner. Here's the first pitch to him. There's a knee high pitch that catches the zone. Matt, this could be a real special end. They've already hit a home run here, and now the real power is starting to come to the plate. We might be in for a light show. Hit hard on the ground towards second. Throw in time at first for route number two. At the plate, number 35. And he's ready to take his first cuts. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. And this is taken outside for ball one. This is hit the other way out toward left field. Reddick on the run. And that ends the inning. So 
is striding in. Carlos Correa. He'll lead it off here to begin the second. A couple lefties start to get loose now in the bullpen. Here comes the first pitch. Now a fastball, a bit too low here. It's ball one. He's ready. Here's the 1 0. And a changeup right down the middle. Slider stayed too low. Ball two. He's set and the 2 1 pitch. Turned on that one and crushed it. Just pulled it a little foul. And when a guy starts leaving the curveball up, that's a sign he's beginning to tire a little bit out there. He's got to be able to get on top of that pitch or he's going to start getting hurt. And another foul ball. Reaches out for one and hits it on the ground to second. Forsyth has it. Throw to first will be in time, and there's one gone here to start the second. So coming to the plate, Marwin Gonzalez. As the switch hitter will take his cuts left-handed here. From the stretch, here's the pitch. And a fastball just a bit up. And that pitch misses in the dirt, and it's 2-0 and now. Well, not a great spot to be in right now. 2-0 and to a great hitter like this. This is when you really have to pay attention as a pitcher. And if you have good off-speed stuff, this might be the time to start mixing in your off-speed stuff. Sitting 3-0 and right here. I wouldn't be surprised to see him turn him loose and give him the green light. Not a good 3-0 swing as he was well behind the fastball there. Here it is on three and one. And he just gets a piece there as this is chopped foul. And a fastball misses there, ball four. Stepping in is Josh Reddick. First shot for him here with a runner at first now and one away. Reddick. Reddick waiting, and now the pitch. And this one's in the dirt. And on the play, the runner moves into scoring position now at second. And he misses low with it, 2-0. and Here comes the 2-0 pitch. Check swing grounder to the right side. Forsyth comes up with it. And safe, says the first base umpire, as the throw was too late. Rich Hill is going to come on in relief now, and he may be asked to eat several innings as this game is just still really getting underway. Alex Bregman will be the first to greet him here as he'll do so with runners at the corners and only one out. First pitch of the at bat on its way. And there's one well above the zone for a ball. Takes this the other way to right. Base hit, and that'll get a run in. Coming to the plate now, Brian McCann. And he could give his guys an early lead if he can come through here. First pitch coming, here it is. Knee high slider that he takes a look at. That's a good pitch right there. Now he's ahead in the count. You got the hitter back on his heels a little bit. Even though it's a tough situation, you know you're going to have to use all your pitches to pitch out of it. Chop foul at the plate here, and it's 0 and 2. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the 0 2 pitch. Nope. Oh, and he dusted him off the plate that time. Some mind games being played now. It's one and two. Sweet. 
And this is fouled at the plate. Ready to deliver the one and two. Again, he sends it out of play. Well, when you're hitting with two strikes, you're just in battle mode. Right there, he gets a breaking ball. He just fouled it off. Got a piece of it and stays alive. Swinging a soft liner. That's in there. Base hit. And they will hold that runner over at third as he'll move up only 90 feet. But the bases are loaded with one away. Charlie Striding in, Morton. Charlie Morton. And a golden opportunity here to give his guys the lead with three men aboard. First pitch of the at-bat. And that slider's almost in the dirt. This is a tough spot in game right here, but when you're a veteran pitcher and you've seen these kind of situations throughout your career, you step back, you make quality pitches, and you trust you'll wiggle your way out of it. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Taylor moves over. He makes the catch. Here comes the runner from third. And he will score as that run breaks the tie and makes this a two to one ball game. Digging in for his second at bat, Jose Altuve. Two's all over the place. Two on, two out, and of course, here in inning number two. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Now started to go down after it and he couldn't hold back. It's strike one. From the belt, the pitch. And this is fouled back and out of play. Here comes the 0 2 pitch. Curveball that time, not even close. Those 0 2 curveballs are really tough for guys to lay off. There's a reason it's such a common pitch in that count, but he did well to spit on it there. Hit the other way out toward right field. Quick giving chase. And the inning is over. So striding forward now. Kike Hernandez. He'll lead things off here in this one run contest. Kike Hernandez. Here comes the first pitch. Thought he had the inside corner that time, but it missed for ball one. The windup and the 1 0 pitch. And that pitch misses in the dirt, and it's 2 0 now. And the pitch. There's a swing, and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. Reddick looks up. That one is out of here. This game is tied. In now, Logan Forsyth, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Now here it comes. And a splitter here, but he had a bit too much on it as this bounces up to the plate. I'm seeing all the signs of fatigue right now. This is when you really have to bear down mentally as a pitcher. Now a fastball for a called strike. It's one and one. Hit to short. Throw on to first, so a good comeback there as he gets the first out of the inning. Seven. Here's the catcher, catcher. Yasmani Grandal. Yasmani one run in and one gone so far in this inning. First offering on its way. And that pitch catches the inside corner. Here's a swing and a high pop up. Bregman is there for it. And he makes the catch for the second out. Now at the plate, Yasiel Puig right try to make something happen Yassiel with two gone in the bottom of the Puig. second. Into the windup and the pitch. Belt high and right down the middle for a strike. Now, Matt, this is the tough part of being the eight hitter. That ball's right down the middle. So it makes me wonder, is he trying to give his pitcher a breather? or is he just Well, the play's been made, and that retires the side. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Cameron Leading Mabin. For 0 for 1 here in the early going. Number three. Cameron Mabin. And a high strike to begin the at bat. It's 0 and 1.
Nope. And that one stayed too low, apparently. Backdoor breaking ball just missed right there. It's such an effective pitch if you can hit the corner with it, but no dice this time. Close pitch, but just a bit outside. He wanted it, but it's two and one. And he fires a fastball now for a called strike two. Into the windup, here comes the 2 2 pitch. And this will miss down low in the dirt, so he's worked it full now at 3 and 2. Hey, I know the idea is to try to get the guy to swing on a 2 2 pitch, right? But that one was so low, I don't know anybody that would have swung at that pitch. I like that combination right there. Show him the curveball, and now that fastball sitting in the low 90s is going to look even faster. Nice job of mixing it up. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the first out. Here's George Springer. Over one for him here in this one. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Great tilt on the slider on the inside corner. The wind up and the 0 1. Off the plate. One ball, one strike. A one and one count. Here's the pitch. Swing and a ball hit softly on the ground. But a foul ball. One and two the count now. Set to deal on a ball and two strikes. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. On his way to second is Springer. And he'll pull in there with a one-out double. Ready for another chance? Carlos Correa. He got on top of one and was a ground-out victim last time. He's set. Here it comes. Too low. 1-0. One, oh. one out and a runner on second base. And misses badly on a pitch down in the dirt. When hitters are able to lay off curveballs and get themselves into good counts because of it, you're in pretty big trouble as a pitcher. A lot of guys rely on their opponents oh, offering at that pitch, even when it's not in a good location to hit. You can bet he's salivating a little in the box right now. He likes to drive in runs, and he's got a great situation and count to do that right here. Swinging away there, it's three and one. Called strike two, and now it's full three and two. Good job going down and hanging with it that time. The payoff pitch one more time. And there's ball four as this one gets away a bit. Here's Marwin Gonzalez now. The first no official at bat for him, but he has scored a run Marwin in this one. Gonzalez. Now a snap throw to first, and he'll get back in safely. And a fastball misses here to start the at bat. It's one and oh. Ready with the 1 0 pitch. And he won't bite at that one either. It's 2 0. Well, I know the last thing he wants to do is load the bases right here. So the pressure is on right now to get back in the strike zone. Hitters count. Here's the 2 0 pitch. Squared that one up just a little late. Ready to deal. Here's the 2 1. And a swing and a miss. Does that look like self defense there? It's two and two. Now a fastball is lifted into the air to shallow center. And that's going to fall for a base hit. And to score is the runner from third. It's a three to two ball game. Stepping in is Josh Reddick. Josh Reddick.
He's set and the pitch. Tough slider down low for a strike. That misses wide. One ball and one strike. He's set. Here comes the 1 1. Now, this pitch is popped up. Playable for Grandal behind the plate. And he'll put this one away in foul territory for the second out. Now, batting Alex Bregman. Two on, two out for him here in the third. Has a look. Now, the pitch. And who looks like he got the call there on the pitch inside. It's nothing in one. From the stretch. And low, it's a ball and a strike. Come on, Dodgers! Here's the one and one pitch. And he lays off upstairs, but it's ruled a strike, and he can't believe it. One and two. Has a look now the pitch in the dirt here. Good job to corral this quickly as the runners hold on. He's set. Here's the 2 2. Good job to spoil that one away and he stays alive. He's ready with the 2-2 pitch. Hit out towards second. Forsythe's able to get there. Throw in time, and the side is retired. Your Brad Peacock is going to come on the pitch here, and in Houston. just the third inning, you have Number to think he'll be asked to eat some Brad innings. Peacock. So digging in now, Rich Hill. He'll get us going in the home half of inning number three. Rich Hill. Bat explodes as this has popped up. And he'll steer clear of the flying debris to make the catch here for the first down. Now at the plate, Chris Taylor. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. He's ready. Here's the first offering. First pitch fastball off the plate there, and it's ball one. 1 0 -oh count. Here it is. And he takes a pitch right down the middle. Look into McCann, the 1 1. Way outside, nearly to the backstop, 2 and 1. He's set and the 2 1 pitch. And that swung on and fouled straight back. Swing and a miss. Looked like the knuckle curved there, and that's out number two. Trying to pick things up where we left off. Corey Seeger. He went deep in his first at bat. We'll see what he's got in store for us here. Here comes the first pitch. Saws him off here as this ball is popped into the air. Oh, and he has some trouble with it. Digging in to try it again. Justin Turner. 0 for 1 here in the early going. Here's the first pitch to him. That gets down, and he's got himself a base hit. Stepping in, number 35. 0 for 1 number for him here in this one. Trying to hang a zero. Here's the pitch. Now a fastball, a bit too low here. It's ball one. Here comes the 1 0. And this one's in the dirt. The runners will hold, but meanwhile, the count moves to 2 0. Ready with the 2-0. Lofted in the air out toward right center. 
Maven on the run. No trouble with this one, and the inning is over. Alex Wood answers the call from the pen here in the fourth as they didn't get the outing they were hoping for from the starter. Here's the catcher, Brian McCann. He'll try to get it going here to begin the fourth. Brian McCann. First pitch hacking here, and that's the first strike. Well, that is a good pitch. A sinker down with that kind of movement, it is really hard to hit. No wonder he swung and missed. And this misses the outside corner, so it's knotted up at one and one. Even at a ball and a strike, here's the pitch. And now a pitch hit sharply on the ground. But this will get foul. It's a ball and two strikes. Now a swing and a chopper foul right at home plate. Now another one two. And that is swung on and missed as McCann is retired for the first out. Now batting. Now to the plate Brad, Brad Peacock. Peacock. Into the windup and the pitch. Took a wave at one around the shins with no luck. Really deceptive change up there. Very well executed. It looks like it just sort of dies when it gets close to the plate. Swing and a miss, and he's in the hole 0 2 now. Way outside. One and two. Oh, this is where you have to be really aggressive. One and two count on an American League pitcher that rarely bats. Go right after him. Swing and a liner. Here's another one, two. A knuckle curve there, and he thought he had him, but it's two and two. I don't know if that was discipline or whether he's just not swinging the bat at all, but hey, at least he's making the pitcher throw a few more pitches. And indeed, the throw will finish him off as they get the put out at first, and there are two away now. Riding in once again, Jose Altuve. First two men in the inning have both gone down via the punch out, so we'll see if he can fare any better. Now a check swing, but he makes contact and hits it out in front of the plate. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. So stepping in, Kike Hernandez. Leading and he's off to a hot start in this one. Homered his first time around. Kike Hernandez. First pitch of the at bat. And this one's down off the shoe tops, 1 0. He's ready. Here's the 1 0. Ball two. Here's the 2 0. Too tight with that one. 3 0. Logan Forsythe will be next. And a good comeback there. It's three and one. And that one right down Main Street. He's set. Here's the three and two. And that misses for ball four. It's a leadoff walk that starts the bottom of the fourth. Now batting. Digging in. Logan Forsythe comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. He's ready. Here's the first offering. A fastball here as he'll take a look at ball one. One and oh. Ready with the 1 0 pitch. And look out as that one ran in and got him. Digging in the switch hitter, Yosmani Grandal. As he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. He pulls this one into right, but he will come on strong out there in right and pull this one down for the first down. And now is Yasiel Puig. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Sliced hard, but foul. Look out over there. Here's the 0-1 pitch. 
Shoots this one over to first. And a backhanded reach at first, but he can't flag it down. And they'll hold that runner at third as everybody moves up a base, and they're loaded with one away. Striding into the box, Alex Wood, as he's got a chance to tie this ball game up with that equalizing run just 90 feet away at third. And a strike called at the letters. Look high to me, but it's nothing in one. From the belt, the pitch. Changeup gets him out in front for strike two. Well, clearly he's not sitting changeup with that swing. I like the early changeup. Now it sets up your fastball and all your other off-speed stuff because now the changeup, anything's faster than that. He's got him off balance now. That's probably not what he wants to do with two strikes right there with the fastball. He is fortunate he just fouled it off. And this is swung on and missed. Oh, a huge punch out there as the bases remain loaded with two away now. From the belt, the pitch. Chris Taylor is in with two away now as he looks at a called strike one. Man, I think he's trying to send a message right here. I'm going to challenge you. I like my stuff. I think I'm better than you. I don't nope. care how good a hitter you are. And this guy's a good hitter, by the way. But he came right after him early in the count. Look into McCann, the 1-1. One -one. Lifted out towards straightaway center field. Maben is there. No trouble with this one. And the inning is over. Here's Cameron Maben now. 0 for 2 on his Houston. line thus far. Center now the Dodgers get a right-hander up and throwing Cameron in their bullpen. Maben. First pitch of the oh, inning is taken play. low and away for a ball. It's 1 and 0. And the pitch. Took a wave at one around the shins with no luck. Ready with the 1-1 pitch. And here's a sinker that causes him to back away as that just about got him. Into the windup, here's the two and one pitch. Three and one. George Springer is on deck. Into his motion, here comes the three and one. Swing and a liner. And he got him at first on a ball that was already in the left field. That's a heck of a play to get the first down. Digging in and looking for more, George Springer. One for two with a double on the ledger so far. Fought off at the plate as it's chopped foul. The windup and the 0-1. And here's a curveball in the dirt that time for a ball. One and one. Oh, uh, shaking his head on that knuckle curve. One and two. In the dirt, but swung on and missed. Grandall gathers, and the throw is in time. Springer is retired. Two down now. Ready once again. Carlos Correa. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Into the windup and the pitch. Swinging a ball hit on the ground. Uh, this is foul for the first strike. The 0 and 1 delivery. And that sinker misses at the shoe tops. Ball one. Here it comes on one and one. Swing and a liner, but foul. Ready to deliver the one and two. And there's a sinker that he just spits on as it misses low. And now pitch on the way. Swing and he puts a charge into this one. High and deep. And you can't forget about it. This ball is gone. Ready for another shot now. Marwin Gonzalez. Singled homer run in his last time up. Marwin Gonzalez. First pitch on its way. And there's one well above the zone for a ball. Here it comes, 1-0. Oh. Wouldn't bite on a good sinker that time that missed. This inning really feels like it's getting away from him out there. As a reliever, you can't let that happen. Nothing you can do about what's already happened, and it's only going to get worse if you're not focusing on the guy in the batter's box. 
now with the base is empty I think he needs to be careful not to just groove one here just because it's 3 and 0 he's a guy that could ambush you and lose one over the wall and he misses ball four stepping in is Josh Reddick he singled in two trips to the plate thus far Reddick now we'll step off the rubber and go to first and a dive but he's back in there for strike one. Oh, one pitch on its way. In the dirt, and now let's see. And he'll make it into scoring position here with two away, as that'll be scored a wild pitch. Here's the 1-1. One -one. This is line to left. Oh, and this deflects right off him. Gonzalez rounds third and is digging for the plate. And this will add on to their lead. It's now a 5-2 ball game. And that'll bring up third the former first-rounder Alex Bregman. A hit in two tries so far. Here's the first pitch to him. And this one gets away. And he'll make it into scoring position here with two away as that'll be scored a wild pitch. The one and no delivery. A knee high sinker tough pitch strike one. He's set here comes the one one. Five runs seven hits no errors in the ballgame for the Astros to this point. And that one stayed too low, apparently. Yeah. And now this ball's lifted in the air down the right field line, but this will get back into the seats, so the count holds at two and two. Another try at two two. Never tempted to swing at that ball down low. It's ball three. For the guy in the mound, this is one of those innings where nothing comes easy. He's thrown a bunch of pitches, and this A.B. hasn't been any different. Definitely laboring at the moment. He's set. Here's the three and two. Ground ball sent back up the middle, and that'll get by into center field for a base hit. And he's going to score with ease as the throw will be too late. Digging in now, Brian McCann trying to keep things going now with a runner at first following the RBI single. From the stretch. Starts him out with a sinker that's inside 1 and 0. Well this inning pretty much has been one to forget for him but he's still out there. and It's only going to get worse if he dwells on it and lets the frustration take over. Easier said than done though. And oh, looked like ball two below the knees but it's ruled a strike and that evens the count at 1 and 1. From the belt the pitch. And he'll take a look at a strike on the inside corner. It's one and two. He's looking pretty passive here, hitting with a chance to drive it a run. Going to have to make something happen with two strikes now. High in the air out to center field. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. Chris Davinsky, a right-handed reliever standing 6-3, gets the ball now out of the bullpen. Chris Davinsky. Now at the play, Corey Seager. He'll lead things off as we begin the home fifth. Now the Astros are going to get a left-hander up and cranking out in the bullpen. And that swung on and missed for strike one. That was a first pitch fastball. He just blew it right by him. You talk about an overpowering fastball working today. He's got a good one going. Gets the fastball by him here, and he's in control 0 and 2. 
The wind up and the 0 2 pitch. Hot shot to third. One away. Stepping up now, Justin Turner. One for two on his line so far in the game. Fastball misses in the dirt as he tried to get him to chase the low one. Into his windup. Here comes the 1 0. Out of play off to the right. It's 1 and 1. Now the Astros have somebody up in the bullpen as a right hander has started to warm up out there. Seared down the first baseline. And a reach, but it's by him as he couldn't quite get to that ball. Ready now, number 35. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. First offering on its way. A fastball that just misses inside. Here it comes, 1 and 0. Off the corner with the splitter, it's 2 and 0. Well, 2 and 0 now, and this is where he makes his money. If he gets a pitch to hack at, you could bet he's not going to hold back. 3 and 0 now. This is what's frustrating at times. You know, he's got a big lead, he's got a four run lead, and then he comes out and doesn't throw strikes. Look, this thing can evaporate real quick if he doesn't throw strikes. That one's in there, three and one. He's set. Here's the three one. Pulled toward right center field. Springer has a read on it. Two gone. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying to move up. Now Ready batting. once again, Kike Hernandez. Perhaps Kike he can drive Hernandez. another one out of the park just like he did back in the second. First pitch coming, here it is. And that pitch catches the inside corner. He's set, here's the 0-1. Ooh, good changeup just missed inside. One and one, here it comes. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Takes a look at one catching the outside corner. Three and two now. Full count with two outs now. So if he could put the ball in the gap somewhere, he could have a good shot of driving in a run because the run at first will be in motion. Neither guy willing to give in, and the ad battle continue. Now a swing and a ball popped high in the air over toward foul ground. And nope, this one falls, so he'll get another shot. Another one sent foul. Count is full. Here's the pitch. Another foul ball, and this battle will continue. Locked in a good battle. Here comes another one. And a good at bat that time as he lays off for ball four. And as a result, that'll move a runner up into scoring position now with two away. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Hit hard towards center. And that's in there. Base hit. Turner rounds the corner and is headed home. And he will beat the throw to McCann safe at home plate. Here's the catcher, Yasmani Grandal. Third trip to the plate for him here tonight. 0 for 2 at this point. Looking to minimize the damage here. Good swing. Just got to try and straighten that one out. Ready with the 0-1. That's over, but low, it's a ball and a strike. Aye. 
up in the zone for him, and he takes a cold strike two. A ball and two strikes. Here's the pitch. And a big strike out there as they'll leave a couple of runners on base, and after a good start to the inning, they can't capitalize any further. Kenta Maeda takes over to start the sixth inning on the mound. Number 18. Evan Gaddis will grab a bat and lead things off here in the Evan top of the sixth. Gattis. Takes a fastball on the inside corner. That pitch looked like it could have been a little high, but he's been calling that pitch all night. Kind of rough for a pinch hitter, but I'm sure his teammates let him know that's where the zone has been. Fastball misses inside. It's even at one. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Hit the target, but this is low, 2 and 1. The 2 and 1 on its way. Now he lifts a high pop up, drifting into foul territory on the right side. And the pinch hitter is retired here, one away. Here's the second baseman, Jose Altuve. He struggled at the top of the lineup in this one, hitless to this point. And now some action in that Dodger bullpen as a left-hander has begun to get loose. This is skied into the air to straightaway center. Taylor has it in his tracks. Makes the play, and there are two gone now. Riding in once again, Cameron, Cameron Maven. Maven. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. Down and away, one ball and no strikes. Into his windup, here comes the 1 0. Takes a knee high fastball. Six runs, eight hits, no errors in the ballgame for the Astros to this point. Swing and he pops him up over toward foul territory. Turner in foul ground. Makes the catch, and that'll retire the side. Joe Musgrove enters to do the pitching in the bottom of the sixth. Number 59, Joe Musgrove. And now is Yasiel Puig. He singled in two trips to the plate thus far. Right fielder, Yasiel Puig. Here's a curveball that runs outside. It's ball one. Now here it comes. And a neck high fastball that time. Here comes the 2 0 pitch. Here's a swing and a ground ball, but a foul ball, and it's two and one now. Into the windup, here's the two and one pitch. Sent foul again, and after being way ahead, now it's even at two and two. Ready on two balls and two strikes, here it comes. Grounded back up the middle, Correa gloves it. And they'll have no play as he reaches first base safely. Oh, and it sailed right over his head at first. Adrian it's Gonzalez come on to pinch Number hit now with a runner at first and nobody Adrian out. Gonzalez. And this is low ball one. Well, with the leadoff man getting on right there, Matt, they are falling so far behind. They have to capitalize. They have to get some runs to get back in this thing. Now Gonzalez awaits the 1-0. And he swings on top of one here and chops it foul right at home plate. Get the runner over. Ready with the 1-1 one -one pitch. Pulls this one into the air out into right field. Springer has a read on it. One out. Ready for another chance. 
Chris Taylor, 0 for 3 with a couple of strikeouts for him to this point in the ballgame. He comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. In the dirt here. And a nice job keeping it close. It's ball one. Here it comes, 1-0. Now a ball line fouled a deep right and out of play. Here's a look over to first and he'll dive back in. Swing and a liner but foul. Got him. And that's the third time we've written a K next to his name in this one. The batter number five. Digging in to try it again. Corey Seager. He homered earlier and is two for three to this point. Good change up there to start him, but it drops a little low for ball one. You know, he's one of their guys they rely on to get their offense going. They need a rally, so we'll see if he can spark one here. And he won't bite at that one either. It's 2-0. Now this is the kind of count this guy feeds on at the plate. You can bet he's geared to hit the fastball right here. Leaves a change up high for a strike. That's an impressive pitch right there. If you're willing to throw a change up on 2 and 0 that tells me that's a pitch you feel really confident with. Three and one now. Three and one here it is. That's lifted the other way out to left. On the move is Reddick. He gets there to make the play, and that ends the inning. Back here at Dodger Stadium. It's on to the seventh now with the Astros on top in this one. And as the final warm up tosses are thrown, let's get a look at our game summary through six innings. Tony Watson is on to pitch now from the bullpen the now to start inning number seven. Tony Watson. Stepping in and ready for another shot, George Springer. He'll be tasked with starting things as we begin the seventh. George Springer. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Hernandez arranged to his left as he tracks this one down in left center for the first down. Here's Carlos Correa now. Comes in one for two with that home run he hit earlier. Sinkers in there, no balls in the strike. That's a big pitch right there. It could change that bat. When you're facing a good hitter like this, that first pitch, strike one, is so important as to who's going to control this at bat. Right now, pitcher's got the advantage. Grounded foul. One out, nobody on. Two strike pitches chopped foul at the plate and will do it again. He's just fouling them off till he gets something he wants to hit. Here comes the 0-2 pitch. Nope. Look That's out, a fastball up near his dome, and that'll wake you up a bit. Here's the pitch. And a wave and a miss on a ball that was way out of the strike zone. There are two away now. The first base pitch. Digging in the switch hitter, Marwin, Marwin Gonzalez. Gonzalez. He reached on a walk in his last time up and later came around to score. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Ball, that's Sinker runs outside to start the at bat, 1 0. Oh. Ready with the 1 0 pitch. Swing and a liner. But this is going to get foul.
Here's the one and one pitch. Changeup gets him out in front for strike two. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. Dribbled up the line. That rolls foul, so a good job to fight it off and stay alive. Here he comes again, one, two. And he'll stay alive here as this is chopped foul at the plate. It'll remain one and two. Well, he tried to get a little cute right there, a little two-strike changeup. He thought he might get a swing and miss, but man, he left that in the zone. He's fortunate that ball didn't leave the park to two balls and two strikes now. Oh, I got to give advantage to hitter in this A.B. Man, he's seen a lot of pitches. He's sitting 2-2. Two, two. Anytime you've seen this many pitches, you now have him measured really well. He spoils another one and will do it again. Ready with another 2-2. Two, two. And the changeup just missed the inside corner. I gotta commend him for being a really tough out right now. Not everyone will battle like this with two outs and nobody on. Neither guy given in. Here's the next one. Hit to third. Turner's got it. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. And it's time for the traditional seventh inning stretch. Ready for another shot now. Justin Turner. He'll start things out here in the bottom of inning number seven. Justin Turner. Into the windup and the pitch. Takes a look down at the knees for a strike. Objective number one right here is finding a way to get on base. So I'm not surprised to see him taking on the first pitch there. Check swing, but he held up in time. Ball one. And he'll come back with one in the dirt as the count moves to two and one now. Well, it's two and one now, and we haven't seen a fastball from him in this at bat yet. As a hitter, you've probably got to sit on that right now. Oh, he wanted that one, but it misses for ball three. There's a knee-high pitch that catches the zone. And he gets a piece here as this ball is fouled away. Another full count pitch home. Just staying alive, putting together a really good at bat here. Another payoff pitch. Went up and out of the zone that time, but he gets a piece of it, and he'll see another pitch. Well, that's three foul balls in a row. He's definitely battling up there. Now a swing and a softly hit ground ball. And the throw to first is in time, one gun. Digging in once again, number 35. He could really use a knock here, 0 for 3 in the game so far. First pitch on its way. And no swing, apparently. Ball one. The 1 0 delivery. Curveball that time, not even close. That's just not a competitive pitch. I mean, that ball wasn't even close. Now the hitter's sitting 2 0. Called a strike on the inside part of the plate, two and one. You're sitting 2-0 in that situation. You get the fastball, but it's not the location you want, so you lay off it. I love that. That's great discipline hitting. But right at the shortstop for the How second out. Left fielder. Keith Call to the bullpen Hernandez. now as Luke Gregerson will take win. over here on the mound. Now pitching for Houston, number 44, Luke Gregerson. Now in the box, Kike Hernandez. It was a walk in his last trip. Here's the first pitch to him. And a slider's in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. Into his windup, here comes the 1 0. Takes a look at a strike over the inside corner. Well, that's a high fastball in the low 90s. That is a dangerous, dangerous pitch right there. He got away with one. The guy took the pitch. Maybe he's just measuring him up. I wouldn't come back with that again. Swing and a high pop-up back onto the outfield grass now. And that will conclude matters here in the seventh. Digging in and looking for more. Josh Reddick. He'll have the first crack the at it here as we start inning number eight. Josh Reddick. 
Reddick waiting and now the pitch. Here's the first pitch chop foul right at home plate and that's the first strike. On its way the 0 1 pitch. Another one fouled off and he's quickly behind 0 and 2. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the 0 2 pitch. Change up and he ain't buying it 1 and 2. Here's the one and two. Flipped out the other way towards short. And a great athletic play to get him. Man, wow. And that'll bring up the former first rounder, Alex Bregman. He's looking for hit number three here in this at bat. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Hit hard on the ground to first. A dive, but he can't get a glove on it. It's through for a base hit. Coming to the plate now, Brian McCann. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. He's going. He's set. Here it comes. Hit swung on and missed the throw. Way late, and he's in there easily at second. Oh, one. Here's the pitch. That's taken. Now it's 0 and 2. Here comes the 0 2 pitch towards second. Oh, he may have been a little disoriented there or something. That's going to allow his man to reach first safely. Carlos Beltran will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. Carlos Beltran. Line to the right side. And this is going to find some real estate out there as he comes through off the bench with extra bases. And the runner from third crosses the plate. Striding in, Jose Altuve. Struggling so far in this one and looking to erase his 0 for 4 ball game right here. And there's ball four now, so the bases are loaded here on the intentional walk, and the force at the plate is in order. Cameron, here's Cameron Mabin now, 0 for 4 with a strikeout thus far. A called strike over the outside corner. Has a look, now the pitch. And Maven comes up empty on that one, and it's 0-2 now. Comes set, now the pitch. A oh, great pitch there as he couldn't get extended on that one, and he's down on strikes for the second out. Number 46 enters from the bullpen to do the pitching. Springer will be the first one to greet him, and he'll bat in a big spot here. Bases loaded and two out in the inning. Looking to minimize the damage here. And there's his strike right down the heart of the plate, 0 and 1. Snuck that high, hard one by him without a swing, but that's a pitch and location he can do a lot of damage with. Got to be careful doing that. This is hit to third. Is he going to get out of this? He is. They get the force at second base, and the inning is over. Francisco Liriano is on to pitch out of the bullpen in the bottom half of the eighth. Francisco Liriano. So striding in, Logan Forsythe. He'll do battle with Francisco Liriano to get the inning underway. Logan Forsythe. And he takes a pitch that's ruled a strike at the knees. Pretty liberal strike zone there. It's 0 and 1. Hard hit ball to second. 
Throw on to first in time, one away. Here's the catcher, Yasmani Grandal. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. First pitch of the at bat. A fastball off the plate away. It's ball one. Liriano into his motion. Here's the 1 0. And there's a pitch that just misses the inside corner. Ready with the 2 0 pitch. Down low, and the clock thickens here. 3 0. On deck, the man they've all come to see, Yasiel Puig, waiting next. And a good comeback there. It's 3 and 1. Now a swing and a fly ball. Springer on the run. He's got it. A nice play there. Two away. Digging in. Yasiel Puig. Two hits and three at bats for him in this one. And a good fastball there, but this just misses the zone for ball one. Hit hard up the middle. And that finds its way through for a base hit. So worst case scenario, a two out base hit and the pitcher will not Your lead off please. next inning. Rob Segedin will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Rob Segedin. Takes a fastball on the inside corner. The 0 1 pitch. Outside for a ball, one and one. Pops this one up, just beyond the infield on the right side. And Altuve will put the squeeze on this one, and that ends the inning. You Darvish enters from the pen to start the ninth the inning as he'll try to keep the score right where it is heading to the you bottom of the ninth. Darvish. Here's Carlos Correa now. He'll begin things here against you Darvish. Carlos Correa. Ninth inning begins as the first pitch is taken for ball one. Here comes the 1 0. And the slider is low and inside as he just about got him there. You know, sometimes it takes a pitcher a few pitches to get going, but those two pitches weren't even close. Falls behind in the count 2 0. It's time to start getting locked in. And a heck of an effort that time, but the throw's too late, and that'll certainly be scored an infield well, single base, to lead off the inning. Number nine. Marwin Into the box, Gonzalez. Marwin Gonzalez. He's one for two in the ball game. He's set and the pitch. In there, no balls in his strike. Prior to the 0-1, here's a look to first. Runners back. Here's the 0-1 pitch. And a good swing there as this is deep down the line and right, but this is going to wind up out of play. Well, he's out in front of that breaking ball right there. Not surprised. I was after that fastball. Nice job of pitching, kind of keeping him off balance. And he makes good contact there, but this is going to find the stands foul down the right field line. Matt, he's thrown two pitches right down the middle and got away with them. I don't think he should go back there again, but he's got to locate a little bit better if he wants to put him away. This guy's too good a hitter. The next go two misses and that'll move it to one and two now. To two balls and two strikes now. Well, that's great discipline. He's clearly sticking with his plan. Those two balls are down. He's thinking to himself, make him get it up before I swing. Get it off the knees. Just hung in there on that one. The two two one more time. Now a swing and he pops him up right up the chute. This may be tough behind the plate. And he'll stay with it here as he puts the squeeze on it for route number one. 
So the striding forward 22. now, Josh Reddick. Josh On the night, Reddick. he's two for four with a pair of singles. First pitch of the at bat on its way. And here's a slider that's nowhere close, and it's 1 0. 1 0 pitch on the way. Inside, and he falls behind the hitter now, 2 0. Here it comes, 2 0. I had him guessing that time as he's barely able to foul it away. He's set, and the 2 1 pitch. Way in front of that fastball. Now a move over to first and a dive, but he's back in. He's set. Here's the 2 2. And the slider misses here, so he runs the count full 3 and 2. We could see the runner in motion here on a 3 2 count with one out. There's a pretty good chance he's going to get a pitch to swing at, and if not, it's ball four, anyways. And that misses ball Third four, base, so it's first two. and second now with only one away. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Alex Bregman comes on with one away as he looks at a ball. It's one and oh. Hey, this game is getting interesting real quick. And the last thing you want to do on the mound is fall behind. Needs to get back in the strike zone right here. Ready with the one and one. Slider stayed too low. Ball two. But a big pass at a slider that gets past him. He's ready with the 2 2 pitch. And a fastball just a bit high. He's set. Here's the 3 and 2. Still hanging with him. Another good swing to keep it going. And here's a ball hit in the air. Number 35 has room in foul territory. And no one can get there. He'll try it again. Locked in a good battle. Here comes another one. And he misses again. Ball four. And that's back-to-back -back guys now that have reached base via the base on ball. Has a look. Now the pitch. Brian McCann comes on with one gone here as he looks at a called strike one. Grounded to the right. Reined in. One there. Back to the pitcher covering. It's a double play and the inning is over. Will Harris will come on now and he'll slide into the seven spot in the lineup following the double switch. Yulieski Gurriel is into the ball game as well as he'll slide into the pitcher's spot hitting ninth now on the double switch. Yulieski Gurriel. At the plate, Chris Taylor, a hat trick already to his credit in this one, so he's looking to avoid the dreaded golden sombrero here. Number three. Just a bit high that time as he misses for a ball. Let's get something started here. here and a strike to even the count. One and one. On the ground up the middle. And there's his first base hit in this one. So the Dodgers get their leadoff hitter on base to kick off the inning. The Digging in, five, Corey Seager. Stop. He went deep Corey earlier, Seager. and he's two for four to this point. First pitch on its way. And there's one well above the zone for a ball. Here comes the 1-0. This is lined to left. 
And that'll get down for a base hit. Ken Giles takes the ball now in inning number now nine, having... looking to close the door. Baseman, Justin Turner. Justin Turner will be his first test out of the bullpen and it'll be a tough test indeed as he'll face him with two on and nobody out here. First pitch coming here it is started to go around but it's ruled strike one anyway. Comes set and the 0 1 takes a fastball on the inside corner. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the 0 2 pitch. Just got a piece of it as it's fouled back. Set to deliver on nothing and two. Here it comes. And he just barely makes contact there as this is fouled at the plate and it remains nothing and two. Hit fairly well out towards straightaway center. Maven has to roam straight back, but he has it for the first out. And he'll get into third here on the flyout, so he's 90 feet away here with one gone. Number 35. Now at the plate, number 35. He lined out in his last trip, so looking for better fortunes here. First offering on its way. Off the plate and away there. One ball, no strikes. Here it comes, 1 0. Oh. Pretty well hit deep down the line in right, but that's back into the seats. Foul. Even at a ball and a strike, here's the pitch. Fouled off again, and now he's in a 1 and 2 hole. Well, now it's a 1 2 count. He's throwing the same pitch three times in a row. He got ahead with it. Now let's see if he puts him away with it. Oh, you can tell he wanted to hold off, but he swings through the inside pitch anyway, and he becomes now out number two. Left fielder, P.K. Hernandez. Looking to wiggle out of this, here it is. P.K. Hernandez is in with two away as he takes a ball, 1-0. He's ready, here's the 1-0. That's inside, 2-0. Two and zero. Oh, here it is. A swing and a miss, just out in front of that fastball. Two balls and a strike. Here it is. Inside with the slider, and that'll back him up a bit. Well, tying run on deck. He should get something really good to hit right here in a three-one count. I'd be sitting on a fastball middle end. And a foul popped behind the plate. McCann has a play, makes the catch, and that's the ball game. Well, the man you see right there had a game to be proud of. He really came through when it mattered, and he's our top player of the game. Yeah, he was a big factor in this one, guys. He swung himself into a three-hit ball game, so he was seeing the ball really well and put some good swings on it, too.